For this style, you will need a heat protectant spray. This is optional, but you may need some duckbill clips. You'll need hairpins, an edge controlled product, and also a flat iron. I've already begun by putting my hair into some large corn rolls. Um, this is just going to really help my hair to just lay flat under the unit. And today I'm going to be working with my Kanekalan Futura Fiber Lace Front Unit. This is in the style Milan. I already have a review for this unit up on my channel, so you could just check the description bar. This will be listed down below. Whenever I work with units with a closure, I always like to make sure my parting is right. So the first thing I'm going to do is just really get my parting to match up to the one on my closure and then we can move on. Once I've decided where I want my part to be, I'm going to take my olive oil edge control and I'm going to use that to slip down my edges. I'm also going to use that to further define my part. So as you guys can see, I'm sweeping the hair away from my part. This is going to make the closure blend a lot more with your own hair and also the texture of the hair on the unit. Don't you worry at all. Once my edges are slicked down, I just move on to putting on my stocking cap. I always do this when I wear units. It gives you a smoother foundation to lay your unit right on top. As you guys can see, this closure blends very well with my own hair. And the wig is very secure because it comes with a lot of reinforcements in the back. So you don't have to worry, especially on those windy summer days. Since you can come with a million guns, a million niggas behind them. To prep the hair for styling, I'm going to take a wide tooth comb and just detangle the hair a bit. I'm not going for a very slick style. This is just supposed to look effortless, but at the same time, I don't want my hair to look tangled and matted. So I'm just going to detangle it with a wide tooth comb. And then it's time to make my braids. For my braids, I'm just taking like medium sections of hair, detangling it with that same wide tooth comb. And then I'm just going to begin to braid it from the roots and almost all the way down to the tips. I'm going to be leaving like a 2 inch space at least for each braid. If you guys aren't familiar with braiding, I'm going to just link a tutorial in the description bar that may be able to help you. So the aim is really to get at least 3 braids on each side of my head. So once I'm finished on this side, I'm just going to move on to the next side and then we can go on to the rest of the style. Say I tell him well, you know, a work of art, I'm being cautious and I open hearts, paint paper with passion passed down from the ones before. Check my roots, these black thoughts speak the truth. So when I let it spew, the only thing I need for you to do is just smile for the nigga. Once I have my three braids on each side, it's time to add some body and volume. So what I'm gonna do is basically what I was doing before. I'm just going to take a couple sections of hair and I'm just going to braid it halfway down instead of all the way down. And once I get to finish braiding, I'm just going to take my Tresemme heat protectant spray and I'm just going to spray this onto the braid. And then I'm going to take my flat iron and just make a couple slow passes on the braids. With the Kanekalon Futuro Fiber, you don't have to worry about the hair burning. Even though it is synthetic, it can take direct heat. So as you guys can see, I'm getting kind of like a braid out curl pattern. I'm just going to repeat this as many times as I want on both sides of my head. And then we can move on to the next step. Just smile for a nigga. Everything will be alright. I seen a bigger picture. Don't worry about a thing. My your baby got ambition. That I got your back through the thin and the thicker. Hold your head up. I'm finna stack this bread up. Torn money pouring from commanding cross to get up. Let's Taking the three braids on one side of my head, I'm just going to take them and wrap them around the opposite side and just secure them with some bobby pins. I'm also going to repeat this for the next side as well. I be last up in the past, chasing behinds, leave you behinds, grabbing the wrong catch up, where buttons against me, can't prosper, armor god is my I wasn't very pleased with that one braid in the front, so I just decided to take it out and let it hang low. And now for my edges, I'm gonna go back in with my um edge control just to slick down my baby hairs and make the style look a lot more natural. And finally to finish off the style, I'm using a little bit of concealer just to blend my closure with my own hairline. And I'm just going to apply that and blend that out. 
So here is how it looks once it's finished. It's a really cute style. You can go ahead and add your hair accessories. And while I sit here and take these endless summer selfies, here are the rules for the giveaway on how you can win one of these units. First, you gotta follow my Instagram, then subscribe to my YouTube channel, and also comment entered below this video. The giveaway ends June 23rd and it is open internationally. Don't forget to check out my other videos. You can click the screen right now. And also check out my brothers Archduke. They provided me with my background music. The links will be in the description bar below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Mwah. Stay naturally beautiful until next time. I had a dream about a man, Paul Farmer, young father.